Not even yourself. Are you okay? Hey, are you okay? I'm fine. Here, this is for you. Huh? A flower? That's right. It's a gift. You know, for scaring those things away. What things? Never mind. Think of it as a memento. Just my luck. I heard that, you know. How much? Well, that depends on the customer. In your case... <laughs> it's on the house. Huh? Lovers used to give these when they were reunited. Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. Oh, I'm sure you are. So? So keep your distance. Wait, you think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self- <gasps> Help me! Never in doubt. All clear. You! You're going in. Let's finish this. That's bad. Sorry. Here we go. Now, <laughs> 
Guess Cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. Mm -hmm. You think he's a keeper? Public security to run around. That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were, at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic-induced hallucination. <clears throat> Never mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. A lot of people here. And in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? Lucky this us. We've got a crowd to hide in. Head for the front of the train and hold there. Due to an explosion at Mako Reactor 1, an emergency schedule is now in effect. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. They said it was an attack, but I'm not so sure. Maybe the freight cars are not so bad. I just wanted to see the moon. I haven't been down in the surface in years. We're oh, going to get the so lights down there. Sorry, I... Uh-oh, uh -oh. nice got a second. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm playing. Just leave me alone, right? You're, uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector 8? I'm a soldier. Wow. My hands are still shaking. You get used to it. Something to look forward to. Or maybe not. Have they caught the perpetrators hit, yet? A little help, Cloud? Please? I'm sure I can't Sector stop thinking about it. Too. The bomb I made shouldn't no, have produced an explosion that, that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? Hmm. You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. go so far as to bomb a reactor. <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Mm. Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, <gasps> quit talking <gasps> out your ass. <sighs> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? Ch just who do you think you are? A law-abiding, concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? <laughs> uh, uh, shh. Don't antagonize him. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. 
A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? Y'all's masters? <laughs> We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world. That's right. That is the Shinra Creed. <laughs> Those fighting words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> Time for a little nap. I didn't hear anything. You gotta believe me. This train is slower than molasses, am I right? Uh, I didn't hear anything. You gotta believe me. Oh dear. Calm down. It's just a sword. Man, this train is slower than molasses, am I right? How much longer till the station? You hear that suit? Shouldn't recreate my ass. Get this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not. There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level, atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. <coughs> Don't worry. Our IDs are impeccable. What'd I tell you? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there gotta struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako while the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you're only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know? Damn, we are good! Uh -huh. yeah. 
Nice. <laughs> Bombs detonated one, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, ah. right. Ah. Hmm. Now get some r, &R. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh. At Seventh Heaven. You know where Tifa works? Don't keep her waiting. She'll worry. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> <laughs> What the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako Junkie, huh? Figures. You again. Shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. Uh, excuse me. Get back, it's uh, due to an emergency, entry into, into this area you know, is prohibited. Sorry for the inconvenience. You call that a warning? No, sir. Remember the last time I saw a real one? Huh? Uh, how sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. 
Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Do you mind keeping Marlene company until I'm done with this? Me? Yeah, you. Uh... Hey! What the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey, I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering Daddy's lessons. <laughs> you know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. <sighs> um, Daddy? Did the people who died all return to Let that be a lesson to you. When you want to talk to a little kid, don't go giving her the professional killer eyes. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was wrong of him to put you in danger like that. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shimmer. Not good at all. So, you make nice with everyone? Much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll Think spread whatever lies Sector Shinra tells 7? them to. The top so, brought this on themselves. it wasn't that bad? It was. Oh, right. And here we are, good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it- There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... 
That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course. As long as you help, that is. Wait. Then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No. Two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so... That'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves 1500. You're the best! I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. Guess it's time for introductions. You okay in there? Oh. Coming in. But he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything. Even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. The 
watch is saying they're gonna step Until they get Searching for candidates. Is that who Wedge mentioned? That sword's massive. What does he sell again? If you don't want to get hurt, keep your distance. Warning. Gate broken. Fiends in area. Exercise caution. No reason to check it out. Not my problem. This year street behind me is Scrap Boulevard. Crawling with monsters. That sword's massive. What does he sell again? Searching for candidates. The trains don't start moving. We gotta stay. Everybody does. We keep putting off maintenance. Do something about the monsters on Scrap Bullet. Even our facilities are starting to look a little. Not alone, you won't. The guy who lives over there's got a real hard on for you. The bombing will likely impact us. Here. Next item. Don't try anything funny or you'll get. The kids seem to think I'm pretty options. Is it just me, or are there more? guy a few times. Looks like a real hard ass, but he's actually pretty chill. Don't rush it and drop your tools. Take your time now, okay? Johnny's not a bad guy, but he... Pretty big mouth that he doesn't know when to keep shut. Yes, enjoy yourselves. Which is better? You're not making this easy. Tifa's got a knack for serving me. It's time to my sister on the plate. Looks like I'm not the only one. A lot more people than you. Yeah.
You look like you got topside connection. Uh -huh. They found out. If you think about it, uh -huh. I've seen that uh -huh. poster. <laughs> If the planet's a living being, we should be learning more about it. Are you serious? You never know. Think we could get some money? I'm not gonna let you sleep over. I still can't. What can we do? Stay focused, even on brain. Gotta admit, the watch is a lot more. What's gonna happen to me? My husband decided huh? to go to. Danger. Falling debris. Keep out. Not going that way. Come on. deserves to go to a good school. A lot more people than you. There's no space, man. Thinking I might join in one of the... But that come on the regular? So you know, Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jessie put her mind to it. Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. 
Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? <sighs> Please? <sighs> Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. Go ahead and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry, we'll pay you the difference after. Barrett's out making his rounds too. As long as I get it all together. The new Loveless musical. All the items you can want straight from the plate. Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? Been waiting for you to... Wait, who's he? Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look? If you're ever in the market for anything else, drop on by. Especially if Teeth is with you. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. All the items you can want straight from the book. He's a regular. Stock up here and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please. Hmm. Just imagine if rich people start thinking it's safer down here than on the plane. My husband decided to go to the station and see if... Hey, Marl. Got some filters for ya. Tifa, 
My dear, dear girl. Oh, what's he? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Don't you still have work to do? Well, go on then. Get back to it. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You been Got here a while now? A Five years, give or take. Was a couple of years back. Uh, but never respect, mind that. We've got to get you your money. Time. Last stop is the Indeed, weapon store. But... Hey, if it isn't Tifa. You here for the filter? Mm -hmm. Hey! That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on- The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? <sighs> Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor? Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the Neighborhood Watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. <laughs> 